Those of us with a dog at home, this is something that has caught our attention. An unknown disease has started to spread across the country. With experts still looking for answers, pet owners are eager to protect their furry family members. 1011's Kendall Lanier has more on how your pet can stay safe. Madison Cole, dogs are a lot like us. A respiratory disease that typically starts as a cough or sneeze can become something much bigger, and that's exactly what's happening. Experts are seeing these symptoms linger for longer than usual, raising concern. Across the country, 14 states are seeing confirmed cases. Nebraska is not one of them. I think the big question that some of the states and other labs are working on is to determine if this is uh, something different or unique or if it's just the routine uh, kennel cough type diseases. Dogs are catching this mysterious disease from each other. It spreads through respiratory droplets, which happens when dogs are in close contact. So just minimizing uh, the number of dogs that are in close proximity to each other. So uh, like with dog playgroups at the shelter right now, we've reduced the maximum number of dogs to four dogs in a playgroup at a time, uh, just with that kind of elevated a sense of concern. With the holidays nearing and dog owners looking to either board or travel with their pets, veterinarians encourage them to make sure their dog is vaccinated. Make sure that the facility that you're taking them to has a high standard of care in terms of cleanliness, requirements for vaccinations and parasite screenings and those types of things because all of that affects immunity in the immune system. The best thing people can do is to pay close attention to their dog's health and take them to the vet. What can start as a cold can become pneumonia and in rare cases lead to death. So the sooner we can get prescribed some antibiotics, which the antibiotics we've been prescribing, they work, it just takes longer for them to work. Um, but it's, it's, uh, it's something that we need to be vigilant about and the sooner that we can catch it, the more we can do about it. Despite the threat posed to canines, owners will still be able to care for them without catching the disease. Research is still being done on what exactly this is, but in the meantime, you can stay alert to any symptoms your dog may be having and have them treated as soon as possible. Reporting in the newsroom, Kendall Lanier, 1011 News.